American Theatre Wing's Tony Award goes to Mike Nichols. And the Emmy goes to Mike Nichols. The winner is... Mike Nichols. Mike One of America's most Mike prolific Nichols. and Mike decorated Nichols. directors, Mike Nichols was among a handful of people to win an Oscar, a Tony, an Emmy, and a Grammy. Mrs. Robinson, you're trying to seduce me. <laughs> His second film, The Graduate, launched Dustin Hoffman's career and cemented Nichols's own reputation in Hollywood. Until this moment, my greatest pleasure in The Graduate was making it. It's a picture made by a group, and we cared for each other and we cared for what we were doing. So this award quite literally belongs to them, at least as much as it does to me. In the decades that followed came more social commentaries on America. There was Silkwood. I said, Thelma is cooked. The Birdcage, Primary Colors, and Charlie Wilson's War. What is U.S. strategy in Afghanistan? No, strictly speaking, we don't have one, but we're working hard on that. Who's we? Me and three other guys. On Broadway, he once had four shows running at the same time. Most recently, he won a Tony for the revival of Arthur Miller's Death of a Salesman, this time starring Philip Seymour Hoffman. I have to thank Rebecca Miller because she trusted us to do Arthur Miller's greatest play. And I got to do his play, and I got to do it with a cast straight from heaven. Among his colleagues, he's remembered as witty, driven, and forceful, sometimes too forceful, but always grateful in the end. And I'd also like to wish my mother a happy birthday. <laughs> Max and Jenny, go to bed. I have to thank the most amazing company, my gorgeous, amazing wife. And I agree with you, she could have done a lot better, but she is my luck. Max and Jenny, you don't have to go to bed. Thank you.